Hey guys, Mr. Kane here. I'm gonna do the YouTube tag that has been going around YouTube lately, Wire Wrap Your Boyfriend. <laughs> JK. Knock, knock. I'm Mr. Kate. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. Oh, hi. I'll drop by for a while. I'll help you find your style. We'll laugh. We'll paint. I'm Mr. Kate. Yay! Just kidding, just kidding. For serious, actually, I'm gonna do these really pretty wire wrapped vases. I think it's a fun way to upcycle vases that you might have hanging around in your cabinet, and it just unifies them all by giving them some pretty blingy wire. Let's get to wrapping. Vases. Wire wrapping vases. DIY. Oh God, I'm always so bad at this. So I love this idea because wire wrap stuff just looks like Grecian and gorgeous. You want to get this kind of wire, they call it floral wire or it's just aluminum wire at the craft store. Even though it's nice and thick, it's still nice and bendable which will really help you out when you're wire wrapping it around your vases. I'm going to start with this big vase. This actually isn't a vase, it's a wine decanter but it can definitely be used for flowers. So I'm going to start with the gold and I'm just going to start wrapping it around the most narrow part of this decanter and then once I have a nice little stack of wire I'm gonna cut the end and I'm leaving these two tails because I have to seal this I'm easily gonna seal it by just twisting these two ends together and then once it feels secure I'm gonna add some design embellishments with my pliers and I'm just gonna start coiling the ends onto each other and this is a really simple move where you just sort of create a spiral effect using your pliers or your fingers and then you can just kind of press them down so that they lay how you want them to lay on the vase. All right moving on to this big guy I'm gonna use this copper colored wire and again wrapping it around the most narrow part of the vase once I'm done twisting the two ends together and then coiling the ends into a shape that I want. Oh my gosh it looks like a mustache but I don't know if I'm gonna leave it like that I think I'm gonna make it a little bit more Grecian looking, but you could totally make a mustache if you want. And then now moving on to my smallest vase. This is like an old kind of milk jug or juice container. And I think I'm just gonna give this a nice thick necklace. So I'm just twisting all the rest of this gold wire around the neck. I don't really wanna make a big spiral design on this one. So I'm just gonna leave a little bit of a tail, twist these together, and then just do a tiny little spiral at the back. And I'm gonna keep this at the back of my vase. Simple, easy, very much up to your personal interpretation. And I'm gonna put some flowers in these. I just used some wire to wire wrap some bases. Because why not? Mr. Kate! Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching everybody. Everybody, can I get a click on this other video? How about this video? How about this video? How about down there? How about a comment? How about a subscribe? How about a subscribe? Oh, we got a winner, we got a winner. Bye.